behind the line, please. We're ready in three, two, one, go. As Autonomous kicks off in this match, first move is coming from the Red Alliance. We see score four points scored for every cargo going up top on either side of the field. It looks like we will have an advantage blue coming out of Autonomous. During auto, they score four cargo, a score of 22 points versus the Red Alliance, 10. Drivers now in control. First move on offense here in Teleop might be coming from Westside Boiler Invasion. They go one for two. Their alliance partners, Team Urbato, also scoring two points for the Blue Alliance. Checking out the action on red, we do see that one of those Red Alliance robots, that is Red Alert. They have some blue cargo in their possession. It looks like they're going to be hanging on to it. That is a defensive strategy that we've seen evolve here in Rapid React this season. Two blue cargo in the manipulator of your opponent are two blue cargo you cannot pick up off the playing field floor. Minute and a half remaining in the match, we've got a tight score. Blue Alliance leads 32 to 20. Taking a look at the cargo action on the playing field floor, lots of options available. We see Munster Horsepower lining up for their shot. They go up two more points for the Red Alliance. Right alongside them, Westside Boiler Invasion go two of their own. Red Alert is chasing down WBI. But meanwhile, Hatchet Robotics able to do some offense for the Blue Alliance on their own. They are hanging on to that Blue Alliance lead with one minute remaining in the match. Red Cargo goes up this time from Robo Blazers, adding four points to that score, narrowing the gap between Red and Blue. The Red Alliance has outscored in terms of number of cargo. Blue still hanging on to that lead after the autonomous period. 10 seconds until we start to see some action in those hangar zones. Getting started a little bit early is going to be Red Alert for the Red Alliance. They go mid-rung. That's going to pick up six points. Their partners, Munster, right alongside them, a total of 12 so far for the Red Alliance. Red Alert is going up for 10, so is Munster. That's gonna be 20 points in the hangar for the Red Alliance. That'll be a ranking point as long as they stay put, but WBI does the same for the Blue Alliance. We have a double traversal for the Red Alliance, at least one traversal for the Blue Alliance. Six seconds remaining in the match, tons of time left. And it looks like two double traversals may be on the field. We will check out your final score in just a moment. We did have tons of hanger points right there at the end, but the winner is the Blue Alliance. Taken at home, 84 to 78. Both alliances earned the additional ranking point for the hangar.